I'm Jared, but tonight in this kitchen, you can call me Chef Gerard. I'm the in-house resident chef at Back to the Roots, an urban mushroom farm in Oakland, California. And right now, I'm gonna show you how to make oyster mushroom prosciutto wraps. To harvest, all I'm gonna do is pull it right out of the box, just like this. I'll cut off a little bit of this end where you see there's some coffee because they grow on recycled coffee grounds. There's recycled coffee right in the box. And then I'm gonna cut them vertically just so we have some nice long pieces that I can saute up. You wanna put it on a medium high heat. Make sure we get a nice sizzle. My grandpa, who taught me how to cook when I was three years old, the most important part is getting that nice sizzle. So I hear it, we'll add a little bit of oil. Then we're gonna put our oyster mushrooms down right on top. Just let them saute for a little while, maybe one or two minutes on each side. And we'll be good to go. So now you can see there, the mushrooms are nice and golden brown. It's gonna bring out that nutty flavor. And if you notice, I didn't add any salt because the prosciutto, which I'll later wrap around the mushrooms, it's got enough salt in it. I'm just gonna add my golden brown oyster mushrooms right into the prosciutto. And that heat from the mushrooms is just gonna heat the meat up a little bit and kind of melt that fat around the edges. It's gonna be delicious. Now, when you're looking for prosciutto, I always like to get the thin stuff, so I kind of like to scout it out and see which is the thinnest prosciutto around. If you ever had prosciutto that's kind of thick, it's not exactly the funnest thing to chew through. So all I have to do is add the mushrooms, just kind of roll it up. Like I said, that heat's just gonna heat the meat up and it's gonna be lovely. And it's time for the taster. Mmm. <laughs> the prosciutto literally just melts in your mouth. And the texture of those nutty oyster mushrooms is incredible.